check out this storage unit who would have known people had so many extra toys that they just let them hang out in the storage unit all the time Audi for the yeah for the sports store yeah I don't know if you can see but here I am following this truck into a sketchy storage unit place to see this motorcycle Amigo, so here we go. This is a 2011 Sportster 1200. Things only got 1400 miles on it. Obviously, has not been ridden a whole lot. He had it parked and covered, so shifted through the gears real quick. Kind of tough in a storage unit, obviously, but so far looks good. Make sure brakes are all right. We'll either need the battery, he said, is a year old, but I don't know if you could see it in the video. Definitely gonna need a new battery or just get charged. I'm just gonna assume it needs a new one. Front brakes are good, rear brakes feel pretty good. Let's check out turn signals, look all right. Good, just sipping around, doing some figure eights, make sure I know what I'm doing on this thing. Check out this storage unit. Who would have known people had so many extra toys that they just let them hang out in the storage unit all the time? Hopefully nobody backs up into me. Bam, this thing's smooth. Yeah, rides like a nice bike with low miles. Not even broken in yet. Comes with a few extra seats, so I will uh, go check out the title and then I'll get cash and count that out. Yeah, it runs great. Shift smooth, brakes are good. Let me uh let me grab some cash. Yeah, I figure I'll leave it running because the battery sounds like it's on its um that way I can at least get it into the truck. I'll throw it on a charger when I get home and... Go ahead and count it out. Oh. 
want to put these in the truck or? Yeah, yeah, let me. Can I check out the title? I think we're good to go. I'm gonna do a quick, uh, another quick spin just to make sure I got a good feel for the clutch and throttle. Right on. All right, so hopefully that all panned out on video. I'm just getting comfortable on the bike, you know. I can't get out of here without them, so they're gonna stick around until I got it loaded up, but. Now that I officially own it, I'm just trying to make sure it's good to roll. On my uh, official ride, I'll go into what I paid for it and all that good stuff, but um, I don't know, cool guys. When I know I'm getting a good deal after I see the bike, I'm not gonna haggle them down more for, you know, battery. If I know going into it, it's gonna need a new battery and I'm unsure and I haven't seen the bike yet, then to avoid wasting my time, you know, I would try to factor that into the price, but at this point I've seen the bike, looks good, everything checks out. I might even be able to charge up the battery, so it's not a guarantee I'll have to replace it. This is a tight U-turn, let's see if I can get it. I don't think that's gonna happen. All right, so we're back at La Casa, and I'm going to unload the Harley, get it in the garage. The true test will be seeing if it actually starts up, because that last start, the battery was pretty dang weak. I don't usually do it with the helmet on, so kind of hinders your field of view, but... All right, let's get the key and see if we can get this sucker started. True moment of truth right here, you guys. Oh, bam. Fires right up. And you know if she fires right up, you gotta take it for a spin. Comes with three seats. I'll decide which one looks the best, and then I'll probably try to sell the other two. I got it from the original owner's father. It's either the original owner, or their son, or their dad, or their cousin, or their second owner's, third owner's, fourth owner's brother. But these sporties, I always have a blast riding around on them because they're just so lightweight, torquey, just zipping around, easy to throw around. Perfect bar hopper. And there you have it, you guys, 2011 Sportster. They stole all my motorcycle parking because I went like three days without a bike in John's Moto Garage. So I'll have to get this cleared out. There she is. So as always, if you dig the content, be sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment below. And stay tuned in the videos to come. I'll do the formal walk around and cold start. And then we'll take this sucker for a ride and I'll let you know my overall impressions on the moto. Again, thanks for tuning in and we'll hit you guys up on the next one. Most famous.